Hey everyone, how's it going? It's your good friend Robert Plank and my website is videosalestactics.com and I want to show you uh, something sort of interesting. I'm not sure if you've seen uh, sometimes on Facebook you're scrolling around you see like people streaming live like doing right now, right? You see people streaming live and then sometimes you also see like oh such and such plans to go live and it's it's sort of interesting and I want to kind of show you how to do that because I just uh, discovered how to do it myself. This cool thing about Facebook is they're always adding stuff and the cool thing about you having an online business is you're always ramping up at least I'm hoping that you're not just kind of like piling in 10 20 different things but you're getting good at one thing and then just kind of tacking on a little inch by inch day by day extra new things in your business so uh, what I want to show you here is this is our membership site called video sales tactics.com you can join it there's the website right there video sales tactics.com and uh, once you're inside there's different you know videos and training on how to do different uh, you know different sorts of hey, things everybody. with your uh, your Facebook live streaming and we uh, you know we kind of scroll through and we actually like show you like literally how to do uh, some of these different things so it's not just theory it's actually like you know showing you how to do these things and uh, what we have we have this big giant start streaming button right here within the membership site so every time that we want uh, that you go and do a live stream we would like it you don't have to but we would like it if you log in and click on this button and what you do is you click on this button and then it gives you the instructions and this thing sort of uh, pops up here. And what happens here is we can uh, uh, go live on our timeline or on our group and stuff like that. And so basically here's here are the options here. For sharing on your timeline, it's good uh, to do it right off the bat just to kind of get comfortable with live streaming. What's also good about this is you can set this so that only you view it. So if I say I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stream on my own wall, which like I do sometimes, like the other day I was kind of walking around the neighborhood and I did that kind of thing. And what you can do is you can stream, but then when you start to do it, and I apologize if this uh, screen looks sort of unfamiliar, you can see at this bottom here, you can say, well, I want to stream just to myself so you can have the sort of safe space and we show you the exact steps and details in our video sales tactics course but you can just stream by yourself and then uh, kind of see if things are okay or stream and then switch it later on and change the public so sort of interesting how you can do that right uh, and so I want to is there a way to go back on this uh, I guess not maybe I'll reload the page uh, so basically you can stream on uh, yeah, I think I got to start over. Okay, so you can stream on your uh, your own wall, right? Stream on your own wall and, or in a group, and that's also fun. But what uh, we've been having a lot of fun with is streaming on our own page, right? When, you, uh, when you're on Facebook, you can set up your own fan page, and you should. If you're any kind of like author, speaker, coach, marketer, like it's good just to have your own page with your own stuff. The big reason for that is with Facebook, the rumor, I guess, is that if you post something on your own wall, Facebook limits your reach to 250 people on your own wall. So even if you have all 5,000 friends or thousands and thousands of friends, you're limited by only 250 people. Now, Facebook's all about sharing, right? So you can stream on one of your pages. Like if I stream onto this boy fans page, I'm embarrassed that that's on there. Uh, but I can stream, say, for example, on our uh, double agent marketing page right I can stream on that page I can share the live stream onto my wall I can share the live stream onto our group so lots of fun there and so I'm going to stream onto uh, my own fan page and there's a reason why I'm doing this I want to show you something that I think is pretty cool and I didn't didn't notice this until today so we're going to stream this on our own page right and we show this in the course and then um, so then what I'm going to do here is I'm going to get this live stream set up and let me uh, see what I wrote down about what I wanted to stream about. So here we'll title our video, right? And this way when it pops up, people know what we're streaming about. I want to say uh, the solution to our, let's see, uh, yeah, being passed over and forgotten, no more. And then I'll put in my website. And then they gave me this little thing. I need to copy it over to a special piece of software. That way they know uh, that it's me. And then when this is sort of starting to come through, I think it might uh, it might then, go forever and ever here. So hang on a second. When this is sort of starting mute myself.
Okay, so anyway, now that we can sort of talk, so basically uh, we can, at the bottom here is where we say go live, right? And this used to be just a regular button, and uh, now it's a button plus an arrow. So check this out. I can say go live, and I can say, well, let me announce to people when I'm going to go live here. So schedule live, and I plan to go live. I'll go live right at the hour, uh, 12.30 p.m. Pacific time. And then this way on my uh, timeline, it'll say Robert Plank gets uh, plans to go live. So I'll schedule this. All right. So now that went away. And then now when I go and I check my Facebook page, here's what we can do is I can go and I can find my fan page. All right. And now when we kind of check this out, see this? So Robert Plank plans on on going live and get reminders. So think about how cool this is, is that if you have if you like, you know, put something in the calendar and I'm going to just say, you know, on Siri. Siri, set an alarm for 1229 p.m. Come on, Siri. All right. Super. So that's all set to go. And so now when people are looking on my page and scrolling through their timeline, they're seeing this plan to go live. And what's really cool about this is if I was going to go live tomorrow, and I, I don't have the patience right now, I'm just going to go live in, in a few minutes here. Uh, so if I was to go live tomorrow, then I could have this post, I could tell people, I could have comments, I could say, you know, uh, here's a PDF document leading up to the live stream, or here's my website uh, leading up to this or stuff like that. So now I can build that anticipation people can click on this get reminder reminder scheduled and then I believe that a reminder appears in their notifications saying that uh, I will go live soon so right now as uh, here's a little other thing is uh, right now it's 12 19 p.m. so I'm just gonna like take a break for 10 minutes and I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna live stream and we'll be uh, rocking and rolling here uh, and so it's sort of an interesting feature right you can uh, co sort of go live right away but now you can also set a reminder for when you're about to go live so pretty cool and I'll see you in a second here all right, so now it's a few minutes later. I changed shirts. That way you know it's me later. And uh, there's a notification here saying Robert Plank plans to go live in three minutes. So imagine if you had hundreds of people clicking on that. Let me show you that once again. So, and I don't want to be late for my own party. So let me, uh, let me put the pedal to the metal here. So when we go here, like we said, uh, ooh, I'm going live in a few seconds. So everyone who clicked on the thing and subscribed got a pop-up saying Robert Plank plans to go live in three minutes. So here's what I can do is, oh, and I used to be able, yeah, if I edit my details, right, this thing pops up and I'm still streaming out of my software and there's a piece of desktop software that I'm not showing you, uh, but basically the thi if I need to stream again to start, I can just grab this again, but right now uh, this is ready to go live and if I do not start within 10 minutes, this will be canceled, so then I will uh, just, let's see, so I think I have to wait until the actual time let's see if this automatically goes live for us so we might have to start it up manually here but oh we have to start streaming some i've had so let me click start streaming and this should just sort of switch over so let's see if we are live all right, cool, so it switched over and we are live. So hey, what's happening? And uh, we're now live. And so I just wanna talk about a, a couple quick things. And you know, one of my, um, I don't know, one of my frustrations for a long time was sort of being, I guess you could call it passed over, right? And it's always like, you see all these big launches, all these people doing all these, you know, emails for each other. And it just seems like there's always just like these groups of people that kind of cluster together. And it's really important, I think, that you find your own group for a lot of reasons. And the big one is because the list takes so dang long to build that it's easier for someone just to have their list 
email to you uh, as opposed to you waiting around and stuff like that. And so, um, and the other thing about that is it's really important for you to have sort of that support system. And, you know, in a lot of ways, like, you know, uh, me and Lance, I hope, are your support system as far as a lot of different things, as far as especially like the technical side, the motivation, the marketing and stuff like that, because there's that sort of saying that a rising tide lifts all boats. And I think that um, it, it's really important that you're around people who kind of challenge you and mo make you want to do better and make you want to do more. More. And by the way, I, I want to let you know that if you don't know me, my name is Robert Plank and my website is videosalestactics.com and I want you to join uh, that course right there because, well, I can't, I can't figure out which hand is which, uh, but I want you to Facebook live stream like you're doing right now and nothing fancy, right? Just with a, a headset and just uh, here in my office and that kind of stuff. So we want you to... Um, to kind of have that that good support system and to have those people that support you and as far as what you do I think it's important that you do something uh, sort of every day that moves your business in the right direction it's really easy to kind of let things slide next thing you know weeks have passed months have passed and you look back saying oh, if only I'd Facebook live streamed uh, every now and then and so it's important that you uh, that you do that and then so something else that kind of comes to mind is that um, you know I was on a, a marketing cruise an internet marketing cruise a few years ago and a lot of people sort of um, sort of heard of me or knew me and I knew a few people there and uh, something that I just heard over and over when I like came across different people was they said oh yeah I remember you from like you know five ten years ago but like I haven't heard of you since and I was wondering you know why that was and I think uh, why that was if I can bring up one of my old websites don't laugh this is a very old website so this is a website and there's like my picture on here right and at a certain point uh, there was just like a period of uh, a few years when uh, I had a few different mentors and coaches, coaches, and they said to take my uh, my picture off my sites. And they said the reason for that is because someone's going to judge you based on like your eye color or your mouth or where you're looking or stuff like that. Uh, and so I took my picture off of my sites, and I think that's why a lot of, of people stopped recognizing me. And me and Lance still would do webinars and stuff like that, but a webinar is usually like a screen, like usually your webinar is like this, right? Where you can't see me, you just see what's on the screen. And that's sort of okay, uh, but then people kind of forget who you are, right? Uh, and so with this Facebook live streaming stuff, I mean, uh, me and Lance made fun of live streaming for a long time because a lot of people like you'll see like their bed behind them or they wear, wear glasses you can see like the reflection in the glasses and stuff like that and I think that um I don't know like I kind of made fun of a lot of it because I I was sort of having that low confidence that low self-esteem about being on camera and I mean it's one of those things where I think that you should you should be on camera and having low self-esteem is normal especially if something out there is in the future and uncertain and all that kind of stuff and I think that you live streaming on a regular basis is a good way for you to to solve that confidence problem and to sort of get over all that stuff right and so uh, you should Facebook live uh, at least once a week at least for five minutes about you know whatever's on your mind whatever you're uh, you're working on whatever you're kind of talking about let me uh, uh, make sure that we're live here because we're talking here and I want to look at uh, and see if there are any uh, uh, questions and stuff on here cool so we got some shares we got some people looking at the stream awesome stuff so here we go I can kind of have my phone in the other uh, hand and kind of see what we're uh, what's happening there uh, so lots of fun there so anyway that, that's that's my, my point of all that is that you, know, you need to get yourself out there and you need to um, you know, be on camera in some aspect because otherwise you're going to kind of get get forgotten and sort of uh, passed over. And what you need to do is overcome that nervousness. And I, I understand it. we all have it. The nervousness of being on camera, the nervousness of uh, your voice and thinking people are going to judge you. Maybe like you're kind of like move your head or you shake your head or whatever. Like I'm looking in the wrong uh, place. I'm, I'm sort of sun, not sun tan, like not sunburn, kind of weird kind of pink skins. Right. Uh, and so, you know, being on camera is sort of one of those scary things. But if you do it a little bit every day, then you'll increase your confidence and you'll get sort of seen more as like a real business person, as a real uh, sort of speaker person, and you'll get better at it, at it uh, as you go along. And you know what too is like, 
you'll you kind of figure out what your talking points are, right? And you'll figure out what kind of uh, things you say that are sort of interesting or that are sort of catchy. And by doing those repetitions, you'll end up by with having like better webinars, better blog posts, better sales letters, better email marketing, just because you'll figure out uh, your own words, right? And haven't you, you noticed that? Like if you've uh, if you ever like sort of not been sure what you were thinking or stuff like that, if you like kind of journaled every day, uh, you, you kind of made better sense of your words right or you think about like if uh, if, if someone goes to, uh, like a therapist I, th I think I was a, I went to a therapist like once like years ago uh, and a lot of that is just like just like talking right and uh, and so just you talking kind of helps to make sense and that's why you know me and Lance look at a lot of when we do like webinars and podcasts and Facebook live streams and blog posts and emails and stuff like that putting things into words helps so much just for us just to figure out like what we're all about just what uh, what we're saying and stuff like that and and so Facebook they will let you stream on your uh, on your phone and stuff like that but I think it's way better to be able to just kind of toss uh, it over to the um, over to the uh, website right and just kind of show something and click around and do all that sort of fun stuff and uh, we want to show you how to do that in our video sales tactics course which you can and should join and video sales tactics.com uh, once you, you should go to the, the site right now and actually I'll uh, I'll open this in a new window because right now the price is super duper cheap and uh, you're, you're going to be shocked at how low the price is for everything you get, right? We uh, help you out and we Hi, show you I'm Robert how Blake. to use this piece of software to live stream because there is a desktop side of things. Like when I go like, oh, I want to switch to me or when I say like, oh, I want to switch to my desktop or if I want to play some other uh, video of me earlier or stuff like that, that is using a desktop piece of software. When I say desktop, I mean both Mac and PC. Uh, and so there's like the, the one thing when I click over on Facebook and start streaming, but then once I'm streaming, I'm, I'm actually recording this stream so I can use it for other things. And then I can kind of switch around and uh, do different stuff. We can run Facebook ads to it. And I think that you need, really need to be live streaming because there's just so much cool stuff. And it's really my hope that uh, just you seeing uh, all the cool things that you can do and all the cool things that everyone else is doing uh, with Facebook, with live streaming, I'm really hoping that that far, far outweighs the nervousness, the low confidence, the uncertainty, all that's like small stuff. The big stuff is, I mean, how much money would you make from this if you landed a coaching client, if you got a couple of extra sales, if you landed a speaking gig, all that fun stuff. Well, you need to put yourself out there. You need to take those risks. You need to do those things that most other people are afraid to do. And there's not even any reason to be afraid. Like once you start doing it, it's easy. You kind of even forget that you're live streaming. I know that I do sometimes. And so video salestactics.com is the place to go. We really want to see uh, you in that course. We want to hear and want to see a live stream. We want to see what kind of fun niches you're live streaming in, what kind of fun uh, kind of content you do. Because, I mean, there's all sorts of possibilities, right? Like you could do a live stream and then open up uh, some sort of thing and just kind of start doodling if you're a doodler sort of person right uh, if you want to kind of show the the uh, your face you can do that kind of person if you want to play another video you can do that so so many different choices for you and Hi, uh, we're Blank both excited for you and we want to see you inside of video sales tactics.com so we hope that you go there right now the place to go is video sales tactics.com to get everything you need to stream live on Facebook. We give you the free software to do it. We show you how to stream your face, how to stream your desktop, how to record a stream, how to play back a stream, how to stream on your wall to any fan page, to any group, how to run multi-person Skype interviews, and then what you do with that sort of technology is up to you. And it's and I think that, uh, and I'm hoping that this is the sort of thing that you just kind of add to your routine. This is the kind of thing that you just kind of do one of these a week or, uh, you know, one of these every once in a while, whenever you have something to say. Uh, and so we look forward to seeing you inside of video sales tactics.com. And I see you in there video sales tactics.com. I'm Robert Plank and thanks for watching.